We have um, around 40 young people on the school roll. Um, all of the young people have special educational needs. They've often had a very negative experience of education before they come to us. They've struggled in that main, mainstream setting. The young people often find it difficult to attend classrooms, like formal lessons, so we have to work creatively. We endeavour to give them a fresh approach to learning, something that they feel that they can be successful with. To base, it's hands-on. It's something that they can actively engage with. It appeals to their interests, but it's also, at the same time, encompasses an awful lot of learning but it doesn't involve sitting at a desk in a classroom for 45 minutes. The work was creative, innovative, a fresh approach, particularly to literacy for our young people. We found that they were working and engaging without actually realising they were doing so, which was an excellent achievement. At the end of it, you see that they're having the best time and they've achieved something at the end. They get to say, actually, yeah, we, we, I can do this. I've made something, I've seen something through to the end and here's the final product. The work that is completed, we link to our ASDAN portfolio courses so young people can actually get qualifications via the work with DeBase. We had the highest number of ASDAN awards this year that we've ever had and much of the work from DeBase was included in that. We can see those skills that they're developing in the workshop. You can see that, that beginning to bear fruit in lessons like English, particularly with their creative writing. Whenever debate takes place, the staff are always very keen to support the sessions. They, they look forward to them as much as the students. And I think Nathaniel's approach is good because the staff can participate in the performance as well. The staff getting involved and the pupils getting involved is bedrock to what we do. If you haven't got a relationship with these pupils, then, then you're not going to achieve much. Their approach is very therapeutic, non-confrontational and Nathaniel and his team work very hard to form positive relationships with the young people. There's one young person that Nathaniel and I have known for many years. His behaviour was very challenging in a formal classroom setting. He was conscious that his literacy and numeracy levels were very low, so rather than attempting work he would just disengage and have a great sense of failure but it's been really enjoyable watching him grow through the base and he successfully secured a place in a music media project in Canterbury and I think without the support from Nathaniel I don't think he'd have been able to achieve that. For us that was a big highlight this year. Debase is one of, if not the best workshops that we use and that's for a, for a variety of reasons, not least because of the way that they engage their children but also the way that they work flexibly with us as a school. Yeah, I would definitely recommend um, Debase for working with young people who have SEN and SEMH needs as well as in mainstream schools just because of the fresh alternative approach to learning. Yeah.